In today's lesson, we are still considering people of different zones. How people in the different zones have adapted to the conditions of those zones. Our focus today is the temperate zone. Remember the temperate zone? Here. The temperate zone. And then the northern hemisphere is the temperate zone. Now the temperate zone is cooler than it is in the tropics. There are three of the original peoples who lived in the temperate zones. A Native American in a ceremonial headdress. A European and an Asian woman. These are the original peoples who lived in the temperate zones. We talked before about the grasslands in the areas of the temperate zone and some people who originally lived in the grasslands followed herds of animals so they did not build homes in one place. Tents could be set up, taken down and carried along by the people as they followed the herds across the grasslands like we have tents here. You remember when we talk about the nomadic people? There are still people who live along the steppes of Mongolia who do this even today, living a nomadic lifestyle. We see that many large buildings have been built in cities in the temperate zones. The roofs of some large buildings in Asia, Japan, China have been built out of tile because clay was readily available. Roofs built out of tiles. There's a variety of food in the temperate zone. There are many kinds of vegetables, fruits, such as apples, grapes, tomato, that grow in the temperate zones. Fish are readily available and animals are raised as well. Remember we talked about the grassland? Well, wheat is a grass that grows in the temperate zone, unlike rice that grows in the tropics where it is hotter and wetter. Since is cooler in the temperate zone, people need to wear heavier clothing, especially in the winter. So fabrics such as wool and heavy cotton keep people warm in the temperate zone. So it's your own turn to carry out research on people that live on the temperate zone or at the temperate zone. See how those people have adapted to the conditions of that area.